Not kill. Where it all started, eh? Every story has a starting point. This is the first place I ever drove a racing car. Coming back here is always like coming home. Children sort of talk about, oh, I want to be a fireman or astronaut or whatever. I always wanted to be a racing driver. When I was two and a half, my dad bought me a go-kart. That sort of set the stage. My first memories are of being around racing cars. You know, my dad stopped racing the year I was born, but still would sit in his old car making racing car noises. You did that too? Yeah. <laughs> Jackie Stewart had seen me racing in that first season. From that point, he was my mentor. The things that we've learned, and but from the people we've been exposed to, yeah. you know, the, the, the way the way we've sort of developed our feeling for cars, our driving styles, we learn to like the same things in a car. We did Daytona 24 hours together, never driven together. We talked to the engineer and he gets the data traces and he's looking. <laughs> they were identical. I mean, like, it was from two laps from the same driver, it was ridiculous. The, the way the throttle was introduced, the way the steering, everything, the gear we used. I blame Dad. I blame Dad. I blame Dad because the way he set up our cars. Porsche has been such a big part of my life from this car onwards, from my professional career taking off with Porsche Cars Great Britain. Well, it started your obsession with red Porsches, so. It did. What's amazing, though, to drive here this morning in a car this old and even a 356 and that DNA. You still feel it in these cars today. <laughs> what a way to spend the day playing around on a racetrack in Scotland with my wee brother and these amazing Porsche 718s. It's mega. These cars are identical specs. They feel very, very similar. That engine is a work of art. I gotta say, being here with my brother in the car that's the brother of this car, it's something special to look across and to see him. What about you, son? Bye, I'm loving being in this thing. Most ways were very similar, but in the slight details, we're definitely different. We have just the same thoughts at the same time. You've got somebody that can finish your senses. Somebody that you've grown up with, that you share that connection with, and then your best friends. Yeah, it's a, it's a special thing. Yeah.